be right with you guys. This is the best part of the movie. I love this. Okay, enough of that before I get copyright. Hey, YouTube. Um, uh, as you can see, we have the duel. The duel, the world's newest, hottest pepper, featuring two pepper X chips, feast and fury, craft potato chips. This is a collaboration with Smoke and Ed Curry. But guys, this is a two-player game, and Strange and Trippy's only one person. But I got somebody to come. Can you guess who it is? I bet I, I bet I can get him to come. Who's it gonna be? Who do you want to see? Oh, I heard the Caperway wants to see the Beast come. Maybe he'll be my partner. Maybe Captain Canada will be my partner. Who's it gonna be? I'll show you who's gonna be. It's gonna be me, the Beast. I'm going to be Strange's partner. Ha. Ah. Just kidding. Beast mode. Strange and trippy. I figured. What the heck, guys? We're gonna do both chips. Ooh. Just stalling, guys. Let's let's have a little bit of a review of this. We have our water. Whoever quits first might be strange. Might be the beast. Who knows? This could be the beast's nemesis. Hot dang show. Um, five minute afterburner. That's what I'm gonna give myself after I eat my chips. Um, because seeing that I'm by myself. Um, yeah, so I can't see myself trying to battle myself more than five minutes. If I do, there's something really wrong with me. Well, guys, let's get into it. So, Feast and Fury partnered with Smoke and Ed Curry of the Puckerbutt Pepper Company. The duel features Ed's newest pepper that tested even hotter than his notoriously famous Carolina Reaper. It's going to burn. Never had anything with Pepper X yet. I still have Reaper Squeezums. I'm going to get to it. Um, so, these chips, oh, warning, these chips are extremely hot. Do or so, so do not consume more than one. Uh, don't eat if you are sensitive to spicy foods. Uh, allergic to peppers, no. Nightshades. Hey, Chase. <laughs> um, or capsaicin, or have any medical conditions, or pregnant. What are you trying to say? So, uh, avoid touching your skin, eyes, and other sensitive areas after touching the chip. If you have any issues after eating, seek medical help. Keep away from children and pets. And don't be a douche and give it to your grandparents. Not cool. Um, so, what is in the ingredients, guys? Potatoes, sunflower, and or sunflower oil. Pepper X powder, sea salt, citric acid. Dot. Period. The end. That's it. There is no more. That is all there is in this chip. So. Nutritional. I'll just leave it there on the. But look at this box, guys. 
I love the color of it. Looks like an old west kind of dual, kind of. I don't know. Like a steampunk kind of. I dig the wood color. Awesome, like goes with all the uh, all the yellow and the oranges. Makes it really pop. Still stalling, guys. Uh, who will be the victor? Will it be strange? Will it be the beast? Who will be the victor? Will it be the beast? Or will it be strange? Who knows? I'm just hoping to survive. No, I'm just kidding. Pain is temporary, guys, as you guys know. But this is the first time I am having this product. I know I've seen other channels with it which was awesome. I've seen uh, Heat 101, they just did it. Here we go. Slicer. Hey guys. Hey you guys. Hey late for work. Keep your eyes open for a package. Don't worry, it's none of this. I'm sorry, I can't afford this. It's something else. Enjoy. So, I'll talk to you later, Jason, about a tracking number. Ah. Okay, back to the, it's going to burn, it's going to burn, it's going to burn me up, up, up. So guys, like I said, pucker butt, pucker butt, pucker butt, pepper company, pure all natural heat. PuckerButtCompany.com. Check them out, guys. Really cool people there. Um, had many of chats with Ed Curry, actually with him himself. Um, not just trying to throw out names. Uh, he was one that kind of pushed me uh, to be silly and be me. Um, do the hot stuff. Do whatever I want, right? So... Thank you. Uh, Brandon over there too, Heat 101. Uh, same thing, uh, like uh, in the beginnings, me and Brandon, like said, chatted about things. Uh, I had a hint that there was something coming and he was like, how'd you know? I just had that feeling there was something coming that some kind of challenge from Puckerbutt would be coming. We haven't really had a challenge from Puckerbutt. So, welcome to the face-off. That will melt your face-off. Your rules. So, as you guys know, some of these rules are going to change because I'm playing by myself. <laughs> um, each jeweler carefully removes your Pepper X chip from the box and prepares a beverage of your choice. Water, water. Uh, stand back to back. Okay, let's skip that one. Um, take three paces. Okay, let's get that one too. Uh, then turn and face your opponent. Oh, 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 also check out feastandfury.com and they have these uh, craft, different craft chips that you guys can feast on. Maybe they'll give you some fury. Uh, some people will, of course. I'm uh, definitely into like the spicy ketchup, uh, cream of horse habanero uh, hickory bacon, and smoky ghost pepper. All right, guys, that was enough of that. We're gonna get into the challenge. Let's go. Oh, by the way, guys, guess what? Here's Ed's coin. Can you see that? Hope you can see that. It's so cool. And then Feast and Fury on the other side. I actually have uh, these coins. Uh, we call them challenge coins in the military. Place the coin down and challenge somebody. If they didn't have one to give, uh, challenge me back, they would have to pay for a drink for me, or I would have to pay for a drink for them. So that was pretty cool. And um, you, you got to collect them and stuff like that. So if I challenged somebody and my and he had a coin, then he got to keep my coin. So then he got to keep it in his collection. So it was kind of cool passing the coins back and forth. Uh, the firefighters, we also did that. It was awesome. 
So, anyways, guys, still Stalin. But look at the green inside. Did I mention the green inside the box? Awesome, awesome, awesome. Stalin, Stalin, Stalin. The duo. The coin. So, basically, if uh, the five minutes ended, uh, we would do Eds or Tails. So, Eds. And then on the other side, Feast and Fury is the uh, tiger. So, tails. But. All right. A little perch. So, I am going to take a little swig of each. All that rambling got me a little thirsty. <sighs> There we go, guys. Ready, aim, fire. Try not to get this on myself because I don't have gloves with me right now. But I do want to see what it looks like. Come on. Oh. Oh. Kind of looks like um, like a hash brown. <laughs> like a, uh, a potato fried on the grill. Like artisan. Like... Uh, Show you in a second. Oh, so guys, the difference in this one, as in the Pocky one, this one is made out of the potato, obviously. Uh, Pocky would be the, uh, I believe it's rice. Because it's like a tortilla, fried tortilla, baked tortilla. So hopefully you guys can see that. So one was full, the other one was a few pieces, which is still cool because it's still going down. doesn't matter. I'm still getting it down. Um, chips are definitely coated on both sides, which is awesome. Because sometimes you know how you get like Pringles and all that, and there's like only one side. What the heck's up with that? So, still stalling, guys. Sorry. I'm gonna run out of that real soon. All right. Here we go. Don't put this in your eyes. Don't put this in your eyes. Three, two, one. I can smell the pepper. Uh oh, what did I do? Instantly dried up my mouth. Woo! Instantly. Uh -huh. Now the video begins. Woo! Wowzers, the tongue. Ah! Wowzers, guys. It went like from like a little bit of heat to like. Oh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, what? What are you doing to my tongue? Excuse me. Don't do that to my tongue. That's my tongue. Oh. Woo. So like I said guys, I'll do the five minute uh, afterburn, uh, supper session, whatever you want to call it, torture, uh, can't say that word, uh, uh, afterburner, it's not attacking my throat yet, which is great, so I can actually talk to you guys, uh, hot, like hot. Give me 
just like it's coating the tongue uh, a little bit on the roof of my mouth. Where am I? On a heat scale right now? Not bouncing all over the place, like I'm uh, moving, but like. I don't have my Steve's air drums. Keep my shorts. Um, it's starting to creep back now into the back of my throat. Good tasting chip. Um, hmm. With this new pepper, I was I wasn't expecting like a reaper taste. I was I didn't know what to expect because I've never had it. So I kind of geared myself for something like that. Um, but. It's not. I find Reaper, like, takes my breath away. I can't talk. Like, this one's just stinging my tongue and, like, in my mouth. It's giving me hot breath. Like I said, eye sweats. No tears. Heat-wise, guys, 0 to 10 right now. We're going into a five. I'd say four going into a five. Beast, don't take the water. Don't do it, beast. You don't need the water. But I do. I need the water. Beast doesn't need the water. Beast doesn't need the water. Strange doesn't need the water. We got this challenge. We're gonna split this coin in two. No, One day, I'll show you my coins. I'll place it with the other ones. Still not, <coughs> still not attacking the throat, guys. It is building a bit more. Um, I'm probably going from a five into a six now. Yeah. Very hot. Like, um, as soon as I had it in my mouth, I was like, uh oh. So, but I did what Ed said on his video when he did it. Try to chew it up as much as you can until it's almost gone. Get the saliva to start breaking the capsaicin down. Thanks for that. Uh, probably still gonna be a gut bomber. But no extracts. No extracts. I'll say it again. No extracts. Heads not about the extracts. I'm sure he does use some and like some, but no extracts in this case, Which is great. Well, guys, that was awesome. Beast and Fury. Pe uh, uh, pepper, but Pepper Company. Pepper X, the newest, hottest pepper on record right now. Check it out. Try it out. Heat, guys. Mm, still creeping, but <clears throat> not much more. Um, it's kind of leveling. I thought it, I thought it was a little spike, but it was just a little piece stuck right there. Um, no, uh, no endorphin rush. Uh, like I said, six, six and a half or ten. Taste wise, out of five, three, because I didn't know what I was getting myself into. But next time, then maybe I'll. The chip was great. Like, the chip itself was great. The pepper 
Um, no dig at, at it or anything like that. I was just oh, wasn't expecting that taste. Uh, so if I ever have it again, I know what to look for. So I say my taste for Pepper X has started to go up because my taste for Reaper is slowly going up. Ooh. Well, there it goes. As you saw, the duel. Great, great, great challenge. Thanks again. And uh, guys, I'll catch you on the next one.